All right, coming up next, it's a Bantamweight matchup between Frankie Signs and Uriah Faber. So here's the newly minted UFC Hall of Famer, the California kid, Uriah Faber. You can make an argument that the lighter weight classes would not even be in the UFC without this man. Former WEC featherweight champion. At times came up short on the big stage inside the octagon, but there is no denying the contributions he made to MMA. When you talk about this featherweight division in particular, you won't be able to do it without mentioning the name Uriah Faber. Uriah Faber is a very experienced fighter with elite level skills in every aspect of the sport. For a long time, he dominated the WEC featherweight division. He's a gifted athlete with a lot of heart and beautiful submission techniques. So you know what this fighter can do offensively, but defensively, I'll be surprised if he gets put on his back tonight. The takedown defense really jumps off the film. Great balance, a solid base, as quick a sprawl as anybody in this division. And a lot of fighters offensively waste a lot of energy trying to bring this fighter down. May want to try to beat him on the feet because if you're going to employ the takedown, more often than not, this guy will sprawl and stuff your shot. This guy is very well-rounded. He literally has no weaknesses in his game. He is technical in all areas of mixed martial arts. And now our tail of the tape for this Bantamweight fight. Even match up here on paper, a lot of similarities across the board, evenly matched when it comes to the numbers. Here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds of the UFC Bantamweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. A mixed martial artist holding a professional record of 34 wins, 10 losses. He stands 5 feet 6 inches tall, weighing in at 135 pounds. Fighting out of Sacramento, Metro, California, the California Kid, And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. Mixed martial artist holding professional record of 12 wins, 5 losses. He stands 5 feet 6 inches tall, weighing in at 135 pounds. Frankie Sands! And with the action begins, our referee in charge, Dan Mergliata. Dan Mergliata. Ready? Ready? First, First round, round underway. Oh, nice strike landed there by Faber. That one hurt. Faber gets caught by that straight punch. That'll get his attention. Welcome to the jungle. Double jab landed there by Frankie Sox. In on a double leg takedown here. Goes for the early takedown. It is good. No surprise that he wants to get this fight to the canvas early. Moves to north-south. He's looking for the windshield wiper choke. That choke looks locked up tight. He's got that pretty good. That's pretty tight. And this might just be a matter of time. Oh, and there's the tap. Great job in establishing that submission. Yeah, so a quick night at the office for him here tonight. He told us he wanted to be efficient. He didn't want to waste a lot of time. He felt his opponent knew the takedown attempts would be coming, and he got the fight to the ground relatively easily, and his submission skills then took over. Big, big result for him early in round one tonight. And here we can see it again. That's a real tight choke here. And let's watch it here one more time. Deep submission and the tap. So a seminal moment for this fighter here tonight as he gets the win by submission. Huge victory in his career. And it'll be very interesting to see how they matchmake him moving forward.
Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dan Lugliano is called to stop for this contest at one minute, 14 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by tap out, the California Kid, Uriah Faber! All right, so the Cali Kid, Uriah Faber, rises to the occasion on fight night yet again. He was oozing with confidence during fight week, and I think now, Joe, we see why he had it all going on tonight as Faber continues to add to a legacy that landed him in the Hall of Fame in 2017. Congratulations to Uriah Faber.